When you enter a store and see that perfect pair of jeans hanging on the rack, you feel much more compelled to buy it on the spot, rather than browse around. Let your customers know when a product is almost out of stock, creating FOMO and a sense of urgency. This in turn leads to more sales, as the customer feels the urge to buy out of fear of missing out on this great offer. Moreover, the retail economy has shown that people put a premium on scarcity. Seeing a product that's about to run out of stock can create a unique sense of urgency. Add to that a special message like hurry or only 7 products left in stock and you can really increase the conversion rate and get the visitor to turn into a customer. The first thing you need to know is that the app takes into account your real inventory. You won't be able to say things like last one in stock when it's not true. Shopify doesn't allow this. If you don't believe me, read their acceptable use policy. Not to mention that the same information will appear on all your product pages and it will make your store look like a scam. The app checks the inventory of your selected option and displays a message based on the amount of items you have in stock. There is a threshold above which we won't show any message. Your customers would not want to know that you still have a thousand pieces in stock for a certain product. In our case on our demo store, that threshold is 20, so a message is shown only if the inventory of a product variant is less than 20. When you want to translate the app or just adjust the wording, you'll just need to make sure to leave this stock tag intact for the reasons I've mentioned before, as it will automatically adjust to your real stock level. You can also instruct the app to show a message on your products that are out of stock but still purchasable, meaning they are marked in your Shopify admin to allow selling when out of stock. Let's check the Shopify admin to shed some light on this. You'll see that this product has 4 variants. No stock on the first two variants, 9 items in stock for the third one and more than 100 for the last one. If you check the first variant, you'll see it has zero quantity, but this option, continue selling when out of stock, is not checked. If we return to the product and check the second variant, you'll see the option is checked. The stock scarcity app in Vitals will display the message for this option, but not for the first one as it's out of stock. Let's return to Vitals and activate the app. Now let's check the product and force refresh to clear the browser's cache faster. The second variant is selected, the one that had no stock but is purchasable, and you can see here the message. The first variant is out of stock, you can't even add it to cart, hence there was no point in showing a message. The third variant has 9 items in stock, hence the appropriate message. The last variant is over the selected inventory threshold, so no message is displayed. If you found this video helpful, make sure you subscribe to the channel as we post new videos every single week. If we can help with anything, please let us know. Our customer support team is available 24-7. Thanks for watching and see you soon.